yesterday Windows 10 was made available for download I'm here on Windows website unfortunately I tried following the directions of trying to install it I clicked here to reserve a date it wasn't easy at all I usually like just downloading the media file like the ISO file to burn to a DVD or a flash drive I usually install from flash drive so Windows does have a tool already uh, they mentioned to use the get Windows 10 app I wouldn't recommend I, I just had trouble using it for normal people they might have easier job anyway so let me go to the my stupid slideshow and so what you want to get is the media creation tool or media creation tool x64 this tool from Win Microsoft Windows downloads Windows 10 install to a USB or DVD file <coughs> so you go to this URL over here and uh, let me show you also on this because it's a little bigger this is the URL you want to go to uh, so once you go there scroll down so near the bottom is you can download the 32-bit version or 64-bit version I'm running 64-bit version so I clicked on here and it'll download it's a small file 18 megabytes then from there it's on my desktop you can see I've already downloaded the Windows 10 ISO files over here so just double click on the file run and it's going to open a prompt so again you just need to go to this URL and you can download the exe file that will let you download <coughs> and run a program that will allow you to upgrade your PC to Windows 10 or create install media from another PC so this is what I wanted to do and you click next and then lets you choose the language I'm going to choose English. Which Windows version you will run? Uh, usually just Windows 10 Home, and then you can choose which versions you want to install or download for the install. And I chose both. And you just click Next, and then it'll ask you where you want to save it, or actually which kind of thing you'll want. This one you can choose either a 60, 6 gigabyte USB flash drive or ISO file. I usually choose the ISO file because I can also install it onto USB flash using the Windows 7 USB maker program and then choose it and then I'm just going to give it a random name and save and then you go to do the download process and you just wait however long your internet connection is good uh, that's how long usually it takes my pretty decent internet speed so it took me like an hour or two to download that's it I just want to make this quick video just in case you're having trouble downloading Windows 10 for install